Good morning, everybody. Today is Wednesday, October 14th, and I'm going to walk you through what you will be working on today. So I am doing the morning message this way because there's something very important that you're going to be doing at the very end of the day, and I wanted to show you all of that, okay? So you're going to go down. You're going to be working on your check-in and attendance for today along with your daily journal prompt. Please make sure you are writing one paragraph. If you do not write one paragraph, I do not mark it as correct. I do not mark that you have done it, okay? So just be aware when your parents get your progress report at the end of the week, if it shows your missing journal prompts and you know you've done them, it's probably because you didn't write a paragraph, okay? For math today, you are working on lesson 3.9, um, which is pages 201 to 206. Um, you'll also be submitting your homework answers. There's a total of 10 problems. Um, what you're doing today is working on subtracting with decimals, so it's really um, similar to what you did before with adding decimals, except for you're subtracting. Um, you'll be working on Imagine Math, as well as uh, your turn problem and solution um, activity in Wonders, along with creating a nation, which is a reading. Okay, that's a really... Um, interesting story. Okay, it's about the Declaration of Independence and it's just super interesting. You'll also be working on Lexia and then today you're writing your final paragraph for your autobiography. Okay, so paragraph number five, you're submitting it to me so that I can give you a grade. It's very important that you do this today. Get it done. Okay, I need to be able to give you a grade so that um, at the end of the term, which the term ends next week, I can give you a grade on your report card, okay? And then for science, this is the part I wanted to walk you through. So for science today, you are taking an assessment, okay? This does count towards your grade for science, um, so it's important that you finish it today. It's also very important that you do not start it and not complete it. You need to make sure you give yourself 45 minutes to an hour to complete the science assessment, okay? This is everything we've learned in science up to now, okay? So it's very important that you do this um, now and today, okay? Don't start it and not finish it because if you don't, it won't save your progress. So you're going to first watch this video. Um, that shows you how to access that assessment in School City. And then you're going to click on, once you've submitted it and you've done everything, it's totally done, you're going to click on, I finished my science assessment here. So I'm going to click on that. And you're going to answer these three questions. So you're going to type your first and last name. Did you complete the entire science assessment in School City? Yes or no. And then was there certain things you struggled with? write at least one sentence and submit. Okay, that tells me that you've done the assessment. I can go in and grade it for you um, so that I know that you've actually done the work that you need to be doing. Okay, um, I hope you have a great day. If you have any questions or need help with anything, please reach out to me and let me know. Again, have a great day. See you in the next video.